Hello viewers, welcome to Big Man Business YouTube channel, today, we're going to be talking about pork. Before we proceed, let's highlight the salient points in this video. Pork is the culinary name for the meat of the domestic pig. It is one of the most commonly consumed meat worldwide. Pork is the most popular meat in the Western world and in Central Europe. It is also very popular in East and Southeast Asia. Global pig meat output in 2020 is estimated at 109.2 million tons, down by 0.8% from 2019. China has long been leading the chart of the world's largest pork-producing countries. Vietnam is the second highest pork meat-producing country. The United States is the world's third largest producer and consumer of pork and pork products. Based on a comparison of 146 countries in 2018, Poland ranked the highest in pork meat consumption per capita with 57.6 kg followed by Hungary and Spain. Average pork meat consumption per capita reached 15.6 kg in 2018 in the world according to Feistat. Despite being ranked as the third largest pork importer by import value, China is in fact the world's largest pork importer and pork consumer by volume. If you're new to the Big Man Business YouTube channel, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell to receive updates on new business expert videos. For more international business news and updates, please visit www.bigmanbusiness.com. Let's delve into the topic itself. Pork is the culinary name for the meat of the domestic pig. It is one of the most commonly consumed meat worldwide with evidence of pig husbandry dating back to 5000 BC. Pork is eaten both freshly cooked and preserved. Curing extends the shelf life of pork products. Ham, smoked pork, gammon, bacon, and sausage are examples of preserved pork. Charcuterie is the branch of cooking devoted to prepared meat products, many from pork. Pork is the most popular meat in the Western world and in Central Europe. It is also very popular in East and Southeast Asia predominantly in mainland Southeast Asia, the Philippines, Singapore, East Timor and Malaysia. It is highly prized in Asian cuisines, especially in China, for its fat content and texture. However, some religions and cultures prohibit pork consumption, notably Islam and Judaism. Global pig meat output in 2020 is estimated at 109.2 million tons, down by 0.8% from 2019, principally due to ASF-induced production contractions in China, the Philippines, and Vietnam. However, the United States of America, Brazil, the European Union, the Russian Federation, Canada, Mexico, and Chile registered moderate production expansions, partially offsetting production contractions elsewhere. Following a 21% fall in 2019, China's pig meat production declined by only 3.3% in 2020 to 42 million tons, indicating a faster recovery of pig inventories from the viral disease, reaching nearly 76% of the level that existed before ASF-led declines began in 2018. Pig meat production also suffered setbacks in the Philippines and Vietnam, as ASF-induced culling pigs continued in some farms. Elsewhere, Pig meat production increased in the United States of America, Brazil, the Russian Federation, the European Union, and Canada. In the USA, output rose, driven by high pig inventories, but the growth rate weakened due to labor constraints and reduced plant capacity utilization. Brazil continued to expand output as import demand remained strong, while government financial support to households stabilized domestic demand. In Russia, Output expansion was mainly due to the high output delivered by large-scale farms and vibrant demand from East Asia. In the European Union, production expansion continued, underpinned by significant output advancements in some member countries, especially Spain and Denmark, principally driven by ASF-free status and access to Asian markets. In Canada, increased slaughtering and carcass weight contributed to the output expansion. The average annual pig meat prices fell from $290 in 2019 to $209 per ton in 2020, a decline of 3.6%. World total pig meat trade reached 11.9 million tons in 2020, up 24.5% year-on-year, helped by Chinese imports, which almost doubled to 5.7 million tons, accounting for around 50% of global imports. Because of the large volume requirements, China issued export licenses to many processing plants in several countries, including Brazil, Chile, and Mexico. Vietnam too registered a sharp increase in imports, 
again reflecting ASF-related output downturns. By contrast, the Republic of Korea and Japan purchased less because of reduced restaurant sales and high retail prices. Concerning exports, much of the expanded exports originated from the European Union, the United States of America, Canada, and Brazil, as extensive initial pig inventories and reduced internal sales bolstered export availabilities. The USA exported 900 tons to China, equivalent to around 30% of total exports, while Brazil's shipments rose by 34% to 1.3 million tons, with nearly two-thirds shipped to China. High imports by China were behind much of the growth in exports from Mexico and Chile too. Despite ASF-related export restrictions to Asian markets, the European Union concluded the year with a 27% growth in exports. In Canada, high inventories and government support under the Emergency Assistance Program underpinned the export expansion. The Russian Federation increased exports by 101%, emerging as a significant global player, with most shipments moving to Vietnam under the Market Access Agreement signed in 2019. Top Pork Producing Countries China has long been leading the chart of the world's largest pork producing countries. In 2019, official notifications had confirmed 129 ASF outbreaks and the culling of more than 1 million pigs by. In addition to culling, in an effort to keep the spread in check, the government is creating separate, self-sufficient zones and ban the cross-regional transport of animals and products. However, the continued relevance of backyard farming and the use of food waste as animal feed may controlling the spread extremely challenging. The transboundary spread of ASF to other countries in the region, with confirmed detections in Vietnam, Mongolia, and Cambodia, will make controlling the spread even harder. According to the Chinese Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Affairs, by March 2019, the hog inventory had declined by 18.8%, and that of the breeding sow by 21% year-on-year. In view of these developments, China's pork output was anticipated to fall by at least 10% in 2019, to 6 million tons. Vietnam is the second-highest pork meat-producing country. The United States is the world's third-largest producer and consumer of pork and pork products. USDA reports that the United States has been either the world's largest or second-largest exporter of pork and pork products over the recent years, with exports averaging over 20% of commercial pork production in most years. Currently, U.S. hog operations are heavily concentrated in the Midwest and in eastern North Carolina. Top Pork Consuming Countries Based on a comparison of 146 countries in 2018, Poland ranked the highest in pork meat consumption per capita with 57.6 kg followed by Hungary and Spain. On the other end of the scale was Jordan with 0.010 kg, Algeria with 0.010 kg and Afghanistan with 0.010 kg. Average pork meat consumption per capita reached 15.6 kg in 2018 in the world according to Feistat. This is 0.835% more than in the previous year and 1.67% more than 10 years ago. Historically, average pork meat consumption per capita reached an all-time high of 15.6 kg in 2010 and an all-time low of 8.00 kg in 1961. The average annual growth amounted to 1.17% since 1961. Top Pork Importers Despite being ranked as the third largest pork importer by import value, China is in fact the world's largest pork importer and pork consumer by volume. Due to the retaliatory tariffs, China has begun importing significant quantities of pork from the United States. China's pork imports are forecast to increase by nearly 2 million tons in 2019, an increase of 35% compared to 2018, with increases in imports of all pork products. Currently, China is seeking alternative meat supplies for the millions of pigs that died due to African swine fever, which has increased the price, revenue, and profits for European and, and South American pork exporters. According to China Customs, in the first nine months of 2019, China imported 1.33 million tons of pork valued at $2.68 billion, up 43.6% in volume and 65.1% in value compared to 2018 of which, Spain, Germany, Canada, Brazil, and the United States are the top five major markets supplying pork to China.
Global purchases of imported pork cost a total $37.9 billion in 2020. Overall, the value of pork imports increased by 38.1% for all importing countries since 2016 when international purchases of pork were valued at $27.4 billion. Year over year, worldwide imported pork appreciated by 18.4% from 2019 to 2020. The five biggest markets for imported pork which is China, Japan, Italy, Germany and Poland bought well over half or 57.1% of the value of global pork imports sold in 2020. From a continental perspective, Asian countries imported the highest dollar worth of pork during 2020 with purchases valued at $19.7 billion or 52% of the world's total. In second place were importers in Europe at 35.6% while 7.7% of overall international pork purchases were delivered to North America. Smaller percentages of 2.5% were bought by customers in Latin America excluding Mexico but including the Caribbean, Oceania bought 1.7% led by Australia and New Zealand, and Africa imported 0.5%. Among the above countries, the four top growth markets for pork from 2019 to 2020 were, China up by 163.5%, Hong Kong up by 29%, Canada up by 24.3%, and the Netherlands up by 11%. Those countries that posted declines in their imported pork purchases were led by, Mexico which was down by minus 15.5%, South Korea was down by minus 13.6%, Germany was down by minus 10.8%, and Italy went down by minus 10.6%. The top 15 importing countries purchased 81.2% of all pork imported in 2020. Top Pork Exporters Global pork exports are forecast 10% higher to 10.4 million tons in 2020, as forecast by USDA. China imports are forecast 35% higher and account for 35% of global pork imports. The Philippines imports are also forecast 32% higher due to disease impact on domestic supplies. Outside of ASF-affected countries, demand is expected to be muted by higher global prices. Many prices-sensitive markets are expected to reduce imports of pork on strong competition from ASF-affected buyers. EU exports are up 13% and Brazil up 20% mostly on growth in exports to Asia. In contrast, Canada's exports are down slightly as restrictions from China limit opportunities for growth. The EU remained a top pork exporter in the world by volume in 2019, with the bulk of its shipments going to Asia, namely China, Japan the Republic of Korea and the Philippines. Notwithstanding the stagnation in production, a reliance on accumulated large meat stocks could allow the EU to expand its exports by 10% this year. Brazil is also one of the world's largest pork exporters. The country may benefit from abundant export availabilities, improvements in the image of its meat quality, and increased or newly gained market access in the Philippines, the Republic of Korea, Vietnam, and South Africa. Global sales from pork exports by country totaled $37.1 billion in 2020. Overall, the value of pork exports increased by an average 34.6% for all exporting countries since 2016 when pork shipments were valued at $27.5 billion. Year over year, total pork exports appreciated by 12.8% from 2019 to 2020. The five major exporters of pork in 2020 were Spain, United States, Germany, Canada, and Denmark. Collectively, that handful of suppliers provided almost two-thirds or 63.3% of swine meat exported worldwide. From a continental perspective, $23.7 billion or 63.9% of all pork exports originated from Europe. In second place were North American exporters accounting for 27% worth. Smaller percentages of 7.9% came from Latin America excluding Mexico but including the Caribbean, Asia exported 0.9%, Oceania mostly Australia exported 0.3%, and Africa exported just 0.1% of pork. By value, the top 15 pork exporting countries shipped 94.7% of global pork exports in 2020. Among the top exporters, the fastest growing pork exporters from 2019 to 2020 were Brazil up by 44.1%, Chile up by 40.5%, Mexico up by 26.2%, and 
and Spain up by 25.9%. Thanks for watching this video. We are open to suggestions. Kindly drop your comments in the comment box and don't forget to subscribe to the Big Man Business YouTube channel. Also, don't forget to share our video with your friends.